Hi everyone, welcome to today's video. All right, now normally I'm really excited about the video that I'm gonna put out. But I wanna be honest on the front end of this video because I don't want anybody to be running to their refrigerator or their pantry, gathering ingredients because I made two recipes today and let me tell you, they were okay. Like they were, they were just okay. So let me tell you what we're making today. My daughter came over and I'm, I'm backtracking right now for you because this has already happened. But my daughter came over and we decided to try to make the viral cottage cheese ice cream that you're seeing on TikTok. Now I don't even have a TikTok. I don't want a TikTok, but she has it. So she's like, mom, look, you have cottage cheese. Let's make it. So we did. And we tried it with a protein powder, or one that I actually like as a protein powder, because you know, sometimes protein powders are just not that good. We tried it with that, we tried it with chocolate, we tried it two different ways, we added additional things, and before you run to your pantry and start collecting things, I'm just gonna tell you it was not that good. So I would give, I would get, well, I'm gonna let, I'm gonna let you kind of hear it, but this video is for entertainment purposes only because I just wouldn't remake this. And I'm not even sure if I would retry it. I definitely could taste sort of the cottage cheese taste. I couldn't get rid of it with chocolate or the protein powder that I used. I don't know. If you've made this before, did you experience that problem? I just couldn't get it to the way that I like it. And I love banana and ice cream, but apparently I can't have that anymore because I'm having so much trouble every time I try. Even a half a banana is spiking my blood sugar, so that has been kind of a no-go for me. I'm gonna try an ice cream, which is like turn it into a sorbet with berries because berries do good for me. So I'm gonna go down that path, but I don't know. I mean, it just didn't work for me. So that said, let's jump into the video. Okay, we're gonna be trying to make the famous cottage cheese ice cream. So you guys know how much I love nice cream with the frozen banana, but apparently that is frowned upon now in this establishment since I cannot have frozen bananas because it's spiking my blood sugar. So this might be exactly what I need. So we're gonna try it. So what you need is two cups of cottage cheese. That is one of these containers. This is 16 ounces. Then I did one scoop of the Ghost protein powder, the Chips Ahoy. My daughter loves this, so I thought I would try this. Now for one rounded scoop, it is seven grams of carbs. And then for this entire container, it would be 12 carbs for the whole container. And then we're gonna do a splash of vanilla. So I have it in my food processor here and I'm just gonna get it mixed up and we're gonna see if it works. Okay, we let this go about, I would say, three or four minutes. My daughter over here is helping me. So let's, let's just scoop it out. There you go. And then just pull that top and... It looks good. It definitely looks like soft serve. It's creamy. Yeah. There you go. Ooh, it definitely looks good. If this tastes good, I would think like maybe... Do you have chocolate chips? I do. We'll go get some of those. And maybe even like um, sugar-free cheesecake pudding mix. Ooh, we should have put that in it. That would be really good. But let's at least try to get the base. See, that looks like soft serve. All right, are you willing to taste it? You taste it. <laughs> I'll taste it. Cottage cheese. You don't like cottage cheese? No, oh, it weirds me out. I used to hate cottage cheese. All right, look at that. It's very smooth. Um, cottage cheesy? No. It needs to be cold for sure. You know, I'm not sure if I'm sold on that protein powder. Mm -mm. Because it's kind of whippy. It's protein powder. It's probably got the protein powder taste. It's kind of whippy. You didn't like protein it? Protein powder taste. <laughs> it's, you know what? It needs to be, this is what we're going to do. Okay, I will say this. Put peanut butter in it. It is, it's too warm. 
for first off. It needs to be in the refri- in the freezer for a long time. I think the um, frozen banana is a million times better, but but I do want to try this the right way. And let's get it cold and we'll see what we think. The consistency is good. And I definitely don't taste, it doesn't taste cottage cheesy. You know what, I think it needs sweetener. Yeah, you know what, I'm gonna put a little bit of, I'm gonna put a little sweetener in this. All right, we, we're adjusting on the fly because we don't really like it. We really don't, we're surprised, but we really don't, we, we don't like it. So we're gonna add some sweetener, which it desperately needs. That's probably, do a full of that. We're gonna put some erythritol in. So we're gonna do about a tablespoon, sprinkle that all through. You know, honestly, I almost think it could use two. That's a lot though, let's don't do two. All right, we're gonna start with that. But you know, I feel like I should have gone with my gut. And we put this on there, Cameron. Um, I feel like I should have gone with my gut and used sugar-free oh pudding mix. Oops, we forgot to put the blender in there. Because that I don't care for how protein powder can get like whipped. Do you guys know what I mean? It gets whippy. I don't like that. So let's see. We're gonna try to fix it. Turn it that way. You gotta turn it that way. Oh yeah, to lock it. Okay. 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 That is better. We just tasted it. That's better. But for me, it's honestly still not sweet enough. So I'm going to do one more tablespoon of the sweetener. Let's do this, Cameron. Here. Put this. We're going to do a quarter cup of half and half. We're going to put that in. And we're gonna see if that doesn't help. Now, listen, this very well could be the protein powder that this is causing the problem. So if that's the case, I will make this again. I'm now officially out of cottage cheese, but <laughs> we'll just buy some more. All right, Cameron, come here. Let's blend this. All right, it is nighttime. It's been a few hours. You can see that this is definitely freezing and it looks like ice cream. It's the consistency of ice cream. And here's what I'm gonna say. I just don't like what I made. I don't think, uh, this is just me. I don't like when you whip a protein powder. I don't like it. I feel like it gets frothy and foamy and I can taste that and it. I don't care for that. So I'm gonna try again. I am going tomorrow. I'm going to buy a bucket of cottage cheese. I think that I'm probably going to do the full fat. And I'm going to try this with sugar-free pudding mix because I think that'll totally work. So, but this, you know, the theory is good. The, the ice cream consistency is perfect. I just don't like that whipped up protein powder thing. How do you guys feel about it? Do you like... Do you like whipped protein powder like that? I don't know, maybe it's just me, but anyway, this is a fail, but I'm gonna keep trying.